Nothing to do as usual, huh? Hmm? <laughs> Why are you here? If you came here to try and convince me, then forget it. It's nothing like that. I just wanted to see how you were doing. Huh? We've known each other for a long time. It's been almost 14 years since we met at the orphanage. You, me, and Miki. We used to run around here until the sun went down. Back then, it seemed like we had all the time in the world. <laughs> you haven't changed one bit. If you want to get all sappy, go do it with your other friends. What was that? It's rare for you to think about the past. Usually, you just charge ahead like a damn fool. So obviously, there's something on your mind. <laughs> I do reminisce sometimes. But what's the point? <sighs> anyway, we finally know how to get rid of Tartarus in the Dark Hour. No shit. Yeah. To be honest, all I've been thinking about lately is getting stronger. But yesterday, someone made me question my reason for fighting. Your reason for fighting, huh? That's different for every person. But if you don't have a good one, you can always quit. Like I did. I'm not like you. Man, I can't believe I'm the one getting lectured here. Well, see you around. You haven't changed at all. Yes? Can I talk to you for a moment? Senpai? Oh, please come in. Not only do you excel at providing support during battle, but also at obtaining information. Oh, I I'm sorry for doing that without permission. Don't worry, you're not in trouble. But I do have a special favor to ask of you. I want you to find out as much as you can about that incident ten years ago. But very little was made public. That's why I want you to access the Kirijo Group's database. You mean, hack into their system? That's illegal! I'll give you my ID and password. You'll be free from accountability. I want to know the truth. In detail. Senpai. Of course, I'll understand if you refuse. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Are you sure? I appreciate it. Yamagishi, aren't you resentful? After all, despite my good intentions, I did drag you into this without fully explaining. Certainly you must be a little angry with me. Not really. You see, my parents have an inferiority complex because all my relatives are doctors. That's why they're so tough on me. It's really hard for me to be at home. But here, I feel important, and I can help you and the others. So why should I be angry? You're right, Yamagishi. We do need you. No one can take your place. Uh, um... Thank you. I'll see you later. So, Tartarus and the Dark Hour will be gone, huh? That's good. That's what we've been fighting for. So why am I so pissed? Gosh, it's hot. Even for July. Seriously. But at least we're seniors now. We won't be wearing these stupid uniforms much longer. Yeah, I've had enough of this. 
I just want to get accepted to college and start having some fun. <laughs> I know why. I'm the reason. I was like, fighting is my duty, but hell, it's all I'm good for. If it weren't for that, I'd be worthless. <laughs> my duty. What a bunch of bullshit. I can't fight worth shit anyway. Not compared to him, at least. Damn it. Nothing I do is good enough. like my worst fears keep coming true. Am I stupid to believe in things like trust and friendship? Dad. This old letter of yours. I must have read it a thousand times since it came last spring. March 6th, 2000. To my family. Tomorrow, I bring this letter to the opening ceremony for the Moonlight Bridge. It'll be stored in a time capsule and sent to you ten years from now. Yukari, you're so small right now, but in ten years you'll be sixteen. You'll be in high school. I know you've been sad because I have to work so late. But you still always greet me with a smile. I'm really proud of myself. Karijo san appointed me head researcher. I'll be starting on a big project soon, and I'm happy to be receiving so much recognition for my work. But I swear to you that nothing is more important to me than you and your mother. Dad. Yukari, are you remembering to enjoy life? Are you still bright-eyed and hopeful, like you are now? No matter what happens in the next ten years, I hope you're happy. Well, I hope this letter brings a smile to your face. Love, Dad. No matter what happens, huh? I can't lose hope. For his sake. I won't turn my back. I won't be like Mom. Not ever.
Fine. Hi, how was your day? It's good to see you again. How long has it been since we first met? Time passes so quickly. So, how's life as a Persona user? I wonder what? I hope you'll find it soon. I remembered something else about the coming of the end. It all goes back to an occurrence that took place many years ago. Ten years ago, if I remember correctly. Hey, didn't your parents pass away about 10 years ago? A persona is like a mirror, which means a persona user can never escape from his true self. Regardless, I will stay with you because we're friends. Good night.